Y'all get ready? Yes, you get Y'all ready. We are gathered here today to sip some tea, honey. So make sure you guys have your teacups ready because this tea is what? Piping hot. Hey, you guys. I hope you guys are doing good today. So just a reminder, please go on to lovelytea.net or amazon.com forward slash shops forward slash lovely tea for all your tea sipping needs. Thank you guys so much for your support and stay tuned for the video. So who made our very first episode of I Don't Give a Shit News 2019? I don't give a shit! The person who made this very first episode is none other than damn P. Diddy, okay? So what's going down is this. If you guys don't know, P. Diddy and Cassie, they've been broke up for months now, right? So recently, P. Diddy caught himself posting a picture of Cassie, and in response, Cassie posted a picture of her and her new damn man, okay? And the new man that she's kissing on is this white guy. His name is Alex Fine, okay? And yeah, he is kind of fine, okay? So anyways, she posted his picture, and a lot of folks were like, well, damn, you know, Cassie done moved on. She's locking lips we thought she was gonna be diddy's wind girl forever okay so she's been out here posting pictures living her best life and now reports are coming in that diddy is livid because a lot of folks are trying to figure out okay well where did cassie meet this guy you know diddy barely let cassie out of his sight so you know how did she end up finding a boyfriend so soon and better yet why is diddy following cassie's new boyfriend so this was a lot of the questions that the fans were asking and now it's being reported that diddy is supposedly pissed off he's really upset and he feels like Cassie was playing him while she was dating Diddy she was also cheating with Alex Fine so what they're saying is that Alex Fine was the person that Diddy hired to train Cassie okay so this entire situation is a hot damn mess I'm gonna go ahead and read to you guys what TMZ is reporting go ahead and check this out so TMZ is saying this Diddy might want to ask for a refund from his former trainer because sources claim that the guy he hired to keep Cassie in shape was banging her on his dime but she says his timeline is wrong. Here's what we're told. Diddy's trainer, Jamel Ligon, got so busy that he hired several other trainers as backup, including Alex Fine. Diddy tagged Alex Fine to train Cassie over the last year. As we reported, Diddy and Cassie broke up several months ago after a decade-long relationship. But our sources claim that Cassie and Alex hooked up before the split. We're told what especially galls Diddy is he paid Alex to train his then-girlfriend and feels betrayed. Cassie sure seems smitten with Alex. She has never ever publicly talked about a timeline, but we're told that Diddy is convinced that there was an overlap. Sources connected to Alex and Cassie insist that the two did not start dating until after she broke up with Diddy. Diddy has bigger issues to deal with, like raising his three children after the death of Kim Porter in November. Diddy was destroyed when Kim died, saying that they were more than soulmates. Honey. All right, so you guys just heard what TMZ had to say. So this entire situation to me is just funny as hell, okay? First and foremost, Diddy's middle name should be Betrayal, okay? He has betrayed so many people, you know what I'm saying? Just shitted on so many people, not just in relationships, but in business and things like that. So Diddy needs to sit down trying to get in his feelings. At the end of the day, him and Alex were not friends, okay? Alex doesn't owe Diddy anything. He doesn't owe him any type of loyalty. If Cassie was feeling Alex and, and you know, flame sparked up that's on Diddy for not treating Cassie right okay he treated Cassie like she was a dog that he could just put on the shelf when he didn't want to feel like being bothered with her and take her off the shelf when he felt like showing her off okay I mean their whole relationship was definitely one-sided and let's keep it real the whole decade-long relationship that he was with Cassie he was also dating and, and sleeping with other women as well okay so I don't see how he can be in his feelings it's funny how people get mad when the same way that they treat other people comes back on them and then they get in their damn feelings about the situation. Cassie probably felt a genuine connection with this trainer that she never felt with Diddy because, because let's be honest, Diddy even admitted that he was very connected to Kim Porter. That was his soulmate. He was always in love with her. So obviously there was never no true connection with Diddy and Cassie. And this person that Cassie's with now, she's obviously feeling some type of connection because
because she's actually showing him off and, you know, showing them kissing. She's flaunting him on social media and everything else. So I don't think he has a leg to stand on because, again, if he really wanted to be with Cassie, if he really respected her, he would have not only treated her better, he would have possibly married her. And to me, he just kept stringing her along. And it's good that Cassie moved on now while she's still young and she's still pretty as opposed to her turning around and being in her late 40s, early 50s, and literally her whole life has been spent, you know, trailing behind Diddy. Unfortunately, that's how Kim Porter spent a lot of her 20s and 30s was running behind Diddy. And I'm glad that Cassie finally woke up and realized that, you know what, she deserves love. She deserves somebody who wants to be with her, you know what I'm saying, and not the whole world. So I'm glad that she's moved on. And she also recently announced, if you guys don't know, that she's going back into the studio in 2019. So I'm definitely here for some new Cassie music. She hasn't dropped any music in years, but Cassie has such a beautiful voice. So it's going to be very interesting to see how this plays out. So this is why Diddy made this episode of I Don't Give a Shit News. I don't give a shit! I don't care about his feelings. I don't care about him being upset about Cassie moving on. At the end of the day, he should have treated her better and not taken her loyalty for granted. So once again, I don't give a shit. I don't give a shit! So do you guys feel like Diddy has a right to be upset and to be offended? Or do you feel like Diddy needs to have a tall glass to shut the fuck up because he was never that into Cassie any damn ways? So anyways, y'all, let's go ahead and get the discussion popping. Go ahead and leave a comment. All right, deuces. Next game! <laughs> Hey you guys, it's your girl T and I hope you really enjoyed that video. If you want to know more about my look of the day or if you want a way to contact me concerning advertisement and sponsorship deals, definitely feel free to click my description box. There's plenty of information in there. Please stay tuned for the next video. Talk to y'all later.